I see that ladle. You want a yodel? Maybe. Maybe later. Marking something? I was earlier. I don't know if there's just something passing through. I don't know anything about fishing though. That's my winger. Area. I actually don't even know what I'm looking for on a Dexler. I just get lucky and say I'm marking something. Why did you buy another scoop? Because mine's broken and that yellow or the orange one on bottom that has the metal handle doesn't float. When it's super cold out, you have to keep digging your hand in the water. Let's have fun. Oh. I guess I never really understood that part, but now I do, so thank you. I feel like if you don't go home with just a little bit of frostbite on your fingers, then is it even worth going out? I never really thought of it that way. But now I have. So yet again, thank you for that wonderful insight. You're welcome. Hold up, hold up. There you go. There you go. Slow, buddy. Slow. Dang. Nice. Sound, that was a good fish. It was. It's one like that. You set the hook, but don't like reel that fast. I didn't reel very fast. You were. No. Review the film. Sometimes you just gotta drop your phone. You'll catch him. Moral of the story is Caleb was uninterested and started looking at TikTok. Not too. Oh, I have a need of pliers. You got here's it. Nice little slab. So, I was just randomly uh, setting, setting a little high, like about a foot off bottom, and that mark just just came up. I didn't see it on screen or nothing. So I go and I, I got another one down there. I go and I just, I mean, I didn't even feel him hit. Honestly, it was just kind of, he was there, and next minute he was on my line and as I get him up I go to take a photo <laughs> and for the gram of course for the gram and he takes and does a little like little spin move on me next thing I know he falls down the hole and I'm without a without a picture a little awkward but you saw the catch. That's what's important. We're not bluffing. Moral of the story is never take photos. Yeah. So sometimes you just gotta like play with the fish, honestly. I mean, sometimes you might be jigging it up high, constant. And then sometimes it could just be like a little, just a little shaking to it. And sometimes they'll even just hit, you just leave it still. But you just gotta kind of play with it and see what gets their attention, what gets them to rise up. So I, what I normally do is I go like two feet off bottom, so I can see the marks, and then depending on that, I'll kind of go from there and see what's if they're following my bait or if they're not interested, and I'll try to change my habit up a little bit. Cooper just kind of lets her rip. He lets the bait do the action. I'm just. I'm just here to have a good time. How many fish have you caught? Today, I had one on, and then I lost it. So half. half so you're not, so half you're not having a good time? It could be better. <laughs> Start crying. <laughs> Shut up already. I'll go sit in the pickup. Come and get me when the fish are biting. <laughs> you guys want some good players? The Cast Kings. 
I don't have anything else cast king, but I got these pliers and I got like a little snipper on them for your line. Man, do they cut. I cut my 50 pound, 80 pound braid and absolutely no problems cutting it. Bunch of different colors too, but awesome pliers. Comes with a good case with it too. But I mean, I've tried the Rapalas, some other ones, and it's just nothing better than these so far. Maybe Cast King will sponsor us now. I think. Maybe. I hope so. Do you have anything else good to say about them? They got a cool name. Cast King, it's your move now. cards are on the table but seriously please sponsor us <laughs> we're begging you we're desperate I'm about to lose the house <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I got four kids to feed <laughs> I just need to catch something my wife said if I don't catch anything she's gonna leave me is that all of the tank need to catch something. Okay, I just had something come up hard as soon as I dropped it down and then just left. He's like, nah. Yeah, I want his wife to leave him. Oh, they removed the dislike button from YouTube. Really? Yeah. So, now we can say that we've never had a video disliked on YouTube. Let's go. Just be the comments. You suck. Use my comment as a dislike button. <laughs> <laughs> it's got more likes than our actual video. What? Are you recording? Yeah. Fuck. Because I don't really want to talk oh. if we're not. Oh, wait. Yeah, it's recording. You don't want to talk to me if it's not recording? Is that what she <laughs> said? <laughs> we're not recording. Okay, good. Please be quiet. Please stop talking. I can only listen to you for so long. <laughs> Honestly, my eardrums, I don't really know if they can handle much more. I seriously might hold my head under the water if you open your mouth one more time. What's Parker up to? Should you show the camera? Well, I guess Parker said he met a fan of 701. I mean, how could you not like us? And he said that man was mind boggled, so I gave him my hat. Parker, you didn't charge him? <laughs> what? He just gave him his hat. I don't know if you guys can see it, but... Looks like he just woke up. <laughs> I gave him my hat. What? For free? Hashtag charge that man. Gave him his hat. What? <laughs> he liked it, I guess? The man was mind-boggled, oh, so I go. gave him my hat. Did he sign it? <laughs> he should have. Should have signed it. Or your blubber. Or my blubber. To make bubble gum. <laughs> you never heard that as a kid? No. Oh, yeah. When we were, like, in school, everybody would be like, you're eating blubber because you'd have gum. And you'd be like, no, I'm not. Never heard that? No. Oh, yeah. It used to be, like, gum was made out of whale blubber. I, I've never heard of that being a thing. Then the kids would push me down and call me a loser. <laughs> It was a tough go. You guys actually said that gum was made out of whale blubber? Yeah, all the time. I no, I never heard that one. Oh. Well, they just look it up. I mean, there was always, like, you know, the teachers and stuff like that that would tell you, uh, like, not to swallow your gum. Otherwise, it'd, like, be in your stomach for seven years. I did that, too. Something just like came up to me really. I mean, now it's done. Thought I was gonna get a, a fish as soon as it dropped, but who am I kidding? I don't have luck. I just wanna win at something. <laughs> 